Good morning mga kahardin. This is Hardinerang Nanay. So our topic for today is about fertilizing your succulents and other plants. But before we proceed, subscribe, comment, and like our videos. Thank you. Actually, ang mga cacti at mga succulents, hindi na nila kailangan actually ng fertilizer kasi they consume what is from the soil. Pero kung gusto mo silang gumanda pa at lumaki pa ng mas mabilis, bigyan mo sila ng fertilizer. Pero ano yung mga pwede natin gamitin? For example, we have the commercial ones like Osmocote that is also good for succulents and cacti. Meron akong ginagamit na fertilizer. Very efficient. Ginagamit ko na siya 2 years na. I'm going to show you how to make it and how to apply it. So here we have it. We have here the compost tea out of sunflower leaves and horse manure. Okay, make sure that the horse manure is already aged or well composted for about six months to one year. Because fresh manure is very acidic and it can kill your plants. Composting also kills the bad stuff found in the manure. We're going to start doing it by chopping first the sunflowers. I'm adding sunflowers because sunflowers have magnesium, calcium, potassium, and phosphorus. So here we're adding the horse manure. Oh, sorry, Basasha. <laughs> Nabasa ng ula, nakalimutan kong ipasok sa loob. Sa sundry ko na lang siya ulit. Pero ito, well composted ito. I use the horse manure kasi siya yung available na malapit. Okay. So, we have here, the horse manure actually composes of phosphorus, potassium, and nitrogen. Tapos, dagdagan natin siya ng tubig. Cover it, put it in a dry, cool place. Store it, pwede na siyang gamitin after two weeks actually. So itong ginagamit ko is 1 gallon compost tea is to 10 gallons of water. So ayan, pwede na natin gamitin. When it comes to the smell, don't worry, amoy na ng pera. Okay. <laughs> smell the difference between the fresh manure and the composted one. The composted one smells good. Sanay na ako eh. <laughs> Mawawala din yan kaagad yung amoy. Okay, I use them also on my begonias and other ornamental plants. And vegetables. Okay, by adding organic matter sa soil like the compost tea, it increases the soil fertility and quality. Before I forget, for succulents, I feed with compost tea for once a month. For other plants, uh, every two weeks. So that's it, mga kahardin. Hope you have learned something today. Thank you for watching. Do remember to subscribe, hit the like, and hit the notification bell. God bless us all.